All right, everybody. Uh, sorry about the delay there. I was uh, trying. I was actually uh, trying to get the uh, XCOM Enemy Unknown uh, booted up here because I wanted to play that one. Honestly, I know the game better than I do XCOM 2, but it just didn't want to actually start for some reason. I'm not sure why that is. On the other hand, uh, XCOM 2 seems to be uh, starting up just fine. So, well, uh, assuming that I granted access to my firewall, yeah, I just, uh, I haven't actually played it since I uh, built this particular machine here. So, my, yeah, it's uh, XCOM and XCOM 2 are, uh, fantastic for Axis games. In fact, I played the original X, XCOM uh, UFO Defense uh, was it early 2000s, something like that. Played the shit out of that. Um, first played it on a PC when a guy I uh, used to uh, visit with uh, went ahead and uh, oh wow, well, that looks like shit. Okay, hey, that's a little more stable. Woot. And I think the game is flipping out over uh, 3440 uh, resolution here. Let's see what I can do. Wow. Hey, let's uh, try widening that out and see what happens. Uh, enable VSync. Yeah, sure, let's do that. There shouldn't really be anything in the graphics setting in, in this game that will really uh, challenge my machine. Let's go ahead and keep these settings right here. That is looking a lot nicer. It doesn't look so uh, weird. Bye. Hey, I, I really like some of these options here. Preset. What are you talking about? Oh, I see. Let's well, auto detect graphics settings. Let's see what happens here. This game is a few years old, but the whole idea of XCOM, UFO defense, and uh, enemy unknown. Imagine that. Is there anything higher? Okay, there's maximum. Let's try maximum. Shouldn't be that too terrible. It shouldn't, but um, so yeah, the original idea of the game of UFO defense and of enemy unknown is that the Earth is getting invaded by aliens. It's a fairly quiet invasion. Um, character pool. Okay, yeah, this is uh, some interesting stuff. Like I said, I haven't. Uh, I'm not as familiar with this game. So the first game, the the aliens invade. You are put in charge of the world's defense force for that. Um, and keep in mind, the world's nations are still trying to keep things more or less a secret. Although, you know, near after a year or two of uh, alien attacks that occur everywhere, I'm sure some jerk got footage on his cell phone. Well, hi there, Lloyd. Welcome. Um, so, what ends up happening, and it's really interesting, uh, so XCOM 2, the idea was that you had failed to uh, actually defend the Earth, challenge appropriate for players familiar with XCOM. Hmm. I think I can manage that. Uh, yeah, I think I'm. I'm definitely at least a veteran, but I. Well, it'll probably be more entertaining for you all to see me uh, get schmucked a few times. So I'll up it one. And I'm going to go ahead and enable Iron Man mode. 
And Iron Man mode is, yeah, every choice you make is final. And, yeah, you're going, if you fuck up, you cannot go back and load a previous save. So, I will have to eat my losses for real. No. I'm not sure. Okay, that's definitely not important right now. <clears throat> So I'm enabling Iron Man here, and I'm going to put this cat on the back of my chair so I can play my game. And hopefully she will let me play and not try to murder me. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and enable this stuff here. And I think there's something I don't want to do initially. I the excitement did... continues to build the city centers across the globe. Prepare for the 20th anniversary of Unification Day. Thousands line up at the site of the Great yep. Accord, celebrating the formation of the Advent Coalition. In keeping with their promise to humanity, 12 new gene therapy clinics will be opening in select cities by the end of the new year. Despite the attempted attack by French elements, operations at the new facility in Paris thankfully remain unaffected. In response to the unprovoked intrusion on the eve of our most beloved celebration, the speaker reaches out to us. Yeah. A small number of dissidents again repeat the mistakes of the old world. Striking as we celebrate the benevolent savior of time and again offers only friendship and compassion. Yet these trivial actions could never break the bond between humanity and the elders. <laughs> Peacekeeping forces have already made several preemptive arrests of known collaborators. Advent again assures all Some citizens that today's shit. celebrations will continue as planned. So, yeah, XCOM 2. You are the terrorists. What's left of the old XCOM trying to bring back the Earth from this bullshit? Compelling storyline. Approaching position. You were right. They've definitely got their hands full today. Stay focused. Prep gate pressure. Sixty seconds. me right off on a ground missions. Well, most of the missions on XCOM are pretty much Now that we've got a foothold, it's time to take the fight to Advent. We're heading into the city center to take down a public target. Something that will get people's attention. Neutralize any security forces in the area. Keep your heads down. Okay. I am definitely going to have to be careful. These guys are going to uh, be pretty badass. It's part of the reason I wanted to play the old XCOM here. Menace 1-5, we have a fix on the target. Move to place the X-4 charges at the designated position. So, it's a turn-based game. 
My guys currently have concealment. They have not been spotted by Advent forces. And, okay. Good stuff. This game use, has a very uh, good fog of war system. Line of sight is properly affected by objects and whatnot. Now, we got cover if I go up there. I can go this far, but if I do go this far, I will not be able to return fire if I'm fired on. So probably what I'm going to do is actually this guy. Yeah, he can move. Uh, Heading out. Okay. These guys make up the bulk of the Advent forces we've dealt with. They're disciplined and well equipped, but their obedience makes them predictable. Uh, what the hell is that thing? Okay, yeah, these guys are pretty much stormtroopers. Unfortunately, they're better shots, though. Now, this guy, I'm going to uh, put him on Overwatch. Fire on the first enemy that moves within your line of sight. So. go ahead and set him to uh, watch. Yes. Please do. So, what do I have to do now? Okay, there's got to be a way for me to switch my soldiers. Okay, cool. That was a little weird. Okay, I'll get used to uh, the controls in the game here soon. Now this guy... I'm trying to get some explosives right here. And obviously, i got to go through these guys. But right now... I could get him in a good flanking position here. Although he will not be able to return fire if fired on. I'll go ahead. Got it. Moving. Uh, all right, Joe. Oh, and by the way, never ever name your characters after yourselves in this game. Because they will die. This game will kill you. It will dash all your hopes of being a good commander. Come on. Time to motor. Yes. Menace one five, you're near the target position. Uh, yeah. So I put them there. Well, if I'm going to run up and far, see, I have no idea what's on the other side of this. But if I get up in here, I'll have partial concealment. Better run up, make a choice and run up. On the move. All right. Yeah, they let me see the guys that I can see. Um, they'll highlight any ones that uh, pop out on me. I've done this mission a while before, and I want to say that there's guys that pop up over here somewhere. So, this lady here... What is the Overwatch thing on this? Oh, they get seen because of these guys. Okay. So, I have this guy here. Pops up, I'm gonna blow concealment for everybody. Wonder if I can nade those guys from here. 
mean, I can literally run right up here and nade, but he will be smoked in short order. So let me run over here. That's affirmative. Oh, this lady here, I should say. Okay. I like that balance. I only take out one guy, though. Okay, um, I'm not going to do that. I'm actually going to grab another party member. Yeah, he's literally right here with these guys. If I nade out, I put it right in the middle of them. Here we go. But I could advance him a little bit. He'll be seen automatically if I do. Yeah, but if I Leroy Jenkins this shit, I will die. Okay, I'm gonna move him out here. He'll be seen. Yes, I've been spotted. I caught that. No shit. They all got reactions, huh? Ah, oh, I should have just thrown the fucking nade. See? This is why it's important not to fuck up. Please report any sightings of these civilians to your nearest Advent station. I'm gonna literally shoot that guy right in the back. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And did not take him down. Okay, that sucks a lot. Bro. You gotta kill this guy. Because I fucked up. Okay. And okay. I fucked up. I totally... Yeah. I move over here. No. Got the best chance of hitting this guy right here. And she missed. How the fuck did you Enemy miss that? Still up. Okay, yeah, I noticed. Alright, so now... Actually, I'll... I'll take this guy's cover away. Oh well, away. better late than never, huh? That car will explode in a moment. Sweet. Now they're coming at us. Uh oh. He's flanking me. Out. Thank you for missing. Oh my goodness. That guy's gonna. That's not what I want to do. Actually, yeah, I want to this guy. And a gun. That hurt. Yeah, uh huh. Anyway. See if I can get the objective before making too much of a hash of it. Jesus yeah, I didn't Christ. Get it. You all suck, you know that? Rolling. Get a 
Yes, if you miss, you're fired. Thank you for not missing. Enemies down! Okay. Yeah, figure that. Hope you survive the combat there, Missy. Okay. Move over here. Understood. Moving out. And 78% chance. It's nice. And there's goodies. Why would you look at that? Okay. Now. Okay, I am flat out running. And I got a goodie. And that's a mod for a weapon. Got some goods here. Hooray. All right. This girl's going to run up. Designated position. Let's. Joe is really, really wounded here, so I'm not going to move him up. Position confirmed. Oh, shit. The Advent officers seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or stricter mind control. Alright, I'm going to try and kill this guy. Did some damage to him at least. Good, good girl. Okay, Joe, you... well, crap. Yeah, at least over here Joe will have an Boys angle of attack. What about this guy? Okay. And these guys here are going to stay put in well this lady here is going to run the hell over here. And Moving on target up. location. Because I need somebody more forward. Uh oh. Just gonna shoot at her. Please don't die. Ow! Oh, she's dead. She just got promoted too. This game is not playing around. Oh, damn, girl. And that character just got wrecked. Oh, no, don't die. Please miss. Fuck me. <laughs> oh. So, half of my party has just been slaughtered. And this guy is all flipping out. Oh, hey, uh, please kill one. Oh, of course he missed because he's panicking and just shooting wildly. Commander, we're taking heavy losses. We may have to adjust our approach. Yep, yep. Well, all I can. Get up there, bro. Affirmative. Moving out. Okay, well, I'm trying to go that far. I don't think. Nope. And he missed. With the 66% chance to hit. Weapons burning ammo fast! Yeah, and they're going to concentrate all fire on him. Good luck, bro. Hooray. I'm taking fire! Ouch. He 
is not dead, hooray. But he will be in a second. And my other guy is, oh, hooray, he's not panicked anymore. Moving to position. Not dead. And okay. Need a resupply. Yeah, I totally borked this mission from the beginning. And those other guys are not any easier to hit. Good luck, bro. Hooray. He's down. Target down. Negative. Weapon try. Well, let's see if he survives to enjoy that promotion. Yeah, these guys are so dead. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> oh, that was brutal. Yeah, I know. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, go start right over here because there's there is no I'm not keeping that lack of progress here. So let's go ahead and start once more. Go with Commander again. Go to next Iron Man mode. See at the beginning here, if you fuck up so bad, it's worth starting over, but later it won't be. The aliens have had long enough to establish their What's peaceful up? enclaves within the city centers. It's time we move in and show them the fight isn't over yet. We're deploying to hit a high-profile target, one that they won't be able to cover up so easily. Move to secure the target site and eliminate any hostile contacts in the area. Any key. Let's try this once more. Oh, they're showing them uh, do their thing this time, huh? Menace 1 5. We have a fix on the target. Move to place the X 4 charges at the designated position. So they sorted out completely different, but okay. So. I'm not going to miss the opportunity to nade a whole bunch of guys next this time. I can promise you that. Good copy. Moving on target. These guys make up the bulk of the Advent forces we've dealt with. They're disciplined and well equipped, but their obedience makes them predictable. There on the mine. So for right now, since I still have concealment, I'm going to run him up over here. Let me use the hell out of this. Menace one five. You're near the target position. Uh, oh, shut up, Central. bunch you guys up. Lesson learned last time, right? Yeah, those two guys only had one hit point and grenade right between them. I would have been proud of that maneuver if I'd been uh, on the opposing team. Move, move, move. Mohawk girl here is going to be tossing the uh, deadly nade out to these buttheads. 
Well, maybe not. There's gotta be a shortcut. Yes, please. Actually, just show me my damn bindings. On the shortcut to easily change units. Okay. Well, yeah, I'm definitely not going to screw this up this time. I hate that reactive Throwing movement grenade. thing. They spotted us. Yep, they did. Okay. Please kill that guy without fail. Oh my god. Target's still up. I could have hit him with a rock from there. Well, she's gonna die. That's what happens when people are simply terrible at what they do, they die. seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or a stricter mind control. Missed. Oh my god. Eso no me gusta. That is so... Yeah, the, the soldiers are kind of terrible until uh, you get a... Uh, and he is literally the last guy and I can't kill him all. I really want to kill that guy. Wish me luck. Hooray. Target disabled. Okay. So. Nice. He died. That's awesome. Uh oh. No. Crap. Oh, and she all good. Like, yeah. And she's just panicking. Hey, at least she took cover. Oh, hey, good luck. You suck. Yeah, and now this guy being marked by the officer is insta dead. Nice. Holy shit. I can't move. Commander, we're taking a 
Taking heavy losses. We may have to adjust our approach. Oh, shut up, asshole. Okay, I need to kill die. Nope. Come on, focus. And they're just gonna murder this uh, panicked girl over here real quick. Uh oh. Nope. I'm dead. Nope. There's more. You dead now? Nope. Is that all you got? Okay. You need to save the day there, uh, Please kill this guy. Oh my god. That's awesome. Okay. Yeah, probably will not live to enjoy it, but yeah. I'm gonna take a is there Yeah. Yeah, if I take cover right there, she'll probably die because she's so close to that guy. Maybe. Position confirmed. That that might work. Okay, let's see if I can kill this guy. I completely missed. Get it together. Just gave me a 70% chance to hit. It's like, no, I can't hit with a full auto bird. Oh, yes. Take the character that can only take one more hit and mark them. Of course. Spectacular death scene. Well, somebody else joined us here, and, uh, yeah, I'm sitting here trying to sort off XCOM 2 here on, uh, Commander Difficulty on, uh, oh, are you, hmm. Let's see if I can hit something here with a 76 chance. Wow, what a shock that I didn't completely fucking miss. And now this guy's gonna just run up and kill me. Oh, I'm not dead yet. Oh, now I'm dead. No. Oh, if I move, I will be. Now I'm dead. Right in the bag. Wow, it's like one of my own soldiers right there. So, essentially, uh, unless this guy misses his overwatch, I'm fucking dead. But... Yeah, I can't, I can't quite catch both of them. The AI is very competent and knows this. 
So, if I do move, I'm dead. If I don't move, I'm definitely dead. Well, let's try it. Dead? Maybe? Uh, oh, yeah! You go, girl. Okay. Oh, I have to reload. I can't even now screw you. You, sir, uh, are gonna die. Take that. Fuck off. Uh oh. Now I'm probably gonna die. Uh oh. And their stuff magically disappears, and now I can't get anything. Yes, I need to reload my weapon. Estoy preparada. Um, yeah, I need better fucking cover. Voy a la ubicación designada. That guy was on Overwatch. Shit. Oh, God. Mission over. Avenger. All XCOM operatives are dead or MIA. Yeah, um, hello. Did base. anybody see the grenades that I was uh, actually looking at there? It didn't hit both guys. You could only hit one guy where that grenade splash was. I mean, you, please pay attention to where I'm showing the uh, actual bubble is. And it also target. shows the affected the squares underneath. The if those squares position. do not light up, that fucking grenade will not hit that square. Just so you know. Okay? Yeah, well, I haven't even had a chance to develop anything yet there, uh, Kevin. Okay, so the mission objective is right there. So for now, well, we know very well what is coming. Okay. These guys make up the bulk of the advent forces we've dealt I with. I wish I could set, their shut Central well the fuck their out. Obedience makes them predictable. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. I wasn't sure uh, what you all saw. Um, but yeah, that... Uh, no, if I could have gotten two guys with a grenade, I would have been happy to, but it only covers nine squares when you're looking on the grid map here. And you can't, you know, even though the explosive radius looks like it, oh, it should kind of clip a little bit into this one or into this one, it will not. It's simply, a, unfortunately, a function of the uh, game setup. Like I said, I wanted to play the, uh, the no. Advent officers seem more oh, wow. Than the grunts. I actually sure got to see them before they saw me this time. Mind control. Menace one five, you're near the target position. Okay. Let's see. Okay, these guys... Yeah, I would really like to be able to get a jump on that officer's group. So, I'm going to go ahead and run this guy over here. Yeah, now once um, the alien hand grenades uh, come into play, that'll help me a lot. Essentially, a whole lot of new gear is going to help me a lot, honestly. But, uh, you know, these guys don't have armor, they don't have med kits, nothing. Just bare bones, x agent. Actually, hell, they're way more. So, I'm going to place this guy in Overwatch just because I'm trying to move. Well, 
I think these squares are supposed to be approximately uh, two meters wide when you look at the way this guy's spread out, which is, or uh, five feet at least from one side along one side. When you consider that, you know, kill radius of 15 by 15 for a grenade really isn't bad. That's fairly plausible. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and bring this guy. Come on, bro. Understood. Moving out. Oh, well, it's this one. Let's see. This lady here. And those guys, yeah, they're way back there. The most important thing is is getting to this objective, honestly. Right now, okay, this person cannot move that way at all without being seen. So, what about this guy? Okay, there's something over here. Oh, a sensor grid. Okay. This guy... Let's... Don't want to bunch my guys up, but... I need them to both get the hell up front for now. I am going to overwatch. Overwatch. That's affirmative. I'm also gonna overwatch. Because if I get discovered, I can unleash fire on them all. Okay. Now, this guy might actually have an avenue to sneak his ass on up there. Moving to designated coordinates. Oh, this girl. Okay, this okay. one's gonna run back here and overwatch. Esperando. Overwatch. On the prize. Also, overwatch. I am gonna just try to be all super stealthy here today. Okay, get your ass up there. Affirmative, moving out. Hell yeah. Boom. We are here. Uh oh. Son of a bitch. Neutralize any remaining hostile contacts. Okay, um, she got her ass hanging out completely. How many dickheads can I see? This guy is has no cover at all. Okay. All right. Didn't want to throw a grenade because there's a civilian right there. I think you, uh... Okay, do I, who do I have to feed? Uh, that guy's not even worth shooting at. Okay. Uh, ooh, what was, ooh, let's see. Yeah, you see how that uh, grid is there with the grenades? It's like, well, it looks like if you place it right here, it'll kind of get them both, but it really doesn't. Because you can see the grid defined of exactly where that's going to affect. Now, this dickhead over here and his cover 
I don't like him, so uh, let's take care of him. Get ready for a surprise! Okay. And... <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, um, where are the guys that she sees? Okay. Oh, and then there's this guy. I should probably get the hell away from the gun gun. It's probably a fairly high priority for me. Um... Good. I'm never gonna hit this guy with my gun. You see how this thing's done working. Take that, bastard. Yes, yes, please go take care of him. And he overwatch. Oh, and I'm getting shot right now. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Please miss. Oh well. Damn it. Why are you guys panicking? You son of a bitch. At least he wasted his overwatch, but Jesus. Bro. I only have one soldier I can control now. Yeah, yeah, he did have a lot of cover. And this one missed. And these two all shitting themselves. Yeah. I'm getting some Understood. real cover here. Thank you. Um, yes. You need to die, dude. With a 70% chance. Got a miss. Shot failed to connect. Yeah. Well, man, she was completely exposed, and I would have done the same thing if I'd done the opponent. Son of a bitch. And she's gonna die now, the only one that's worth a show. Oh, she didn't. Great. Oh yeah, major morale drop. I mean, it's like, uh, but then again, um, people in this game, I don't remember what the stat is called, they essentially have a, uh, a stat that uh, gives you an idea of how easy they are to panic. Have to neutralize all enemy targets. Okay, I'm gonna move to oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. cover. Yeah. So, 49%. In other words, I have pretty much no chance of hitting him. But he will kill me. Oh, hey! That's awesome! I got him! Nailed him! Ah, uh, this fucking game is depressing sometimes. With the, uh... Oh, yeah, you got a 70% chance to hit. You'll never fucking hit him. Jesus.
you know? Well, screw you. I'm going to take cover in here. I'm going to shoot you in the fucking face. Well, if I miss with an 85% chance... Hooray! Okay, that's all my movements this turn. I somehow miraculously still have three soldiers, but they all only have one hit point. Oh, she's dead now. And if you assholes uh, panic again, you're fired. Oh, hey, this one has more than one. Oh, shut up, Central. It's flat. Point flip. Let's see what happens. Next. Draining ammo fast. Yeah, boy. Hooray! Enemigos pacificados. Arma seca. Okay. Let's see if these guys live long enough to do anything. Preparada. They want me to kill everything in here before I can leave, so I'm going to go ahead and over here. This guy's weapon is also dry. I think I'm gonna reload him. Yes. <laughs> and put him on Overwatch. Scouting. And we'll try to pick this thing up. Hooray. Do for her as Okay, bro. Um, you get up there. Affirmative, moving out. So I know there were jerk offs over there. I'm on it. Hostiles are moving. Yeah. They could even be coming around that way. I'm going to run her over Ayabon. here and check that. Good copy. Moving on target. Uh, there Ayabon. they are. I have no grenades on this guy. Not really good odds on any of those. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and go Overwatch and hope that that uh, full cover helps me. Good luck, bro. Get him, get him, get him. Come on, bro, get him. Shoot, shoot, shoot. What the hell, bro? Are you. What are you doing, man? Oh. Okay, if I hit him, I'm gonna mad. Of course he didn't. What? Took some sudden damage, huh? Nice, you go, girl. So I have two troops. Oh! Two bad guys I gotta take out with this uh, lady here. That off 
so it was way over there. with this. Good luck, we're all getting Of course. Ooh, surprised she didn't die. Bro, it's... Try it. Try it on Commander. Give it a shot. It's called Classic Mode in the old XCOM. They just get murdered super bad. They only gave you four for this uh, for this mission here. Oh yeah. Don't do any better damage with the grenade, so. And he's not dead, so I'm dead. Me quedo sin munición en el arma. Recibimos fuego intenso. Ooh, that's not good. Completely exposed. And dead. Avenger, all XCOM operatives are dead or MIA. I'm returning to base. Yeah, so this is like, damn. on the target. Move to place the X4 charges at the designated position. Let's see. I'm gonna take a break because beating my head against this is uh I'm not I need to sit back I need to step back for a moment and uh kinda think about uh what the fuck I'm doing wrong here exactly. Uh I could bitch about game systems and stuff like that, but that's not exactly helpful. The, uh... Oh my god. And I'm sitting here using my keyboard shortcuts for the game, and it's trying to, uh... Well, for my stream, and it's trying to uh, make changes in the game for me. So let me actually, uh... Not do that. No. Uh, Anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and take a couple minutes. All right. I'll, all right. I'm going to go ahead and be back here in a minute, and I'll talk to you soon.
Alrighty, I am back. And, oh, uh, almost anyway. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, yeah, and I did one of my shortcuts and was trying to, uh, trying to, uh, take actions for my soldiers. So let me, uh, swing around people. But I was, anyway, bottom line is, they, uh, I was kind of operating under the idea of one objective here, let's go, uh, blow that statue up. But obviously, that is not the case. We have to go kill all the soldiers, and we have to blow up the statue. So, I'm going to make secondary objective my primary. And, not buckets, because I'm not predictable. Target position. The Advent officers seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or stricter mind control. Probably stricter mind control. I'm gonna put her over here. On it. She's a badass. That shit would kill me. I would be so dead. So, two soldiers to each location where there be baddies. Try and start the party at the same time with these groups here. Okay. It's gonna be hard as hell. Okay, because these civilians apparently will. Uh, well, maybe not. That feels so unsafe to move up here this far. It really feels really all kinds of unsafe. Let's check it out. Though. I'm probably going to die. But then again, that's what I did before. So... Aha, uh -huh. I like how they plot a course. Oh, I would be visible to those guys. Hmm. I'd be outside. They're in the perfect spot. She's in the perfect spot. Him. Move him Moving over to here position now. Let's see what happens. Oh, well, Overwatch? Thank you.
Bad thing is, as soon as I open up on either of these groups, they're all going to reposition. I can only get one of them and it's not the officer. See, it's like I can only get, I can get two here. That's it. Because of their position. I'm going to kill that damned officer. up here with this guy, but he would be super exposed if those guys up there take a Orders confirmed. Moving out. Uh, Here. There we go. See, that's worth breaking concealment for. Wish me luck, guys. One down. Okay, this is the... Okay, so she's the last one I have to work with here. Okay, which... Yeah, well, he's the guy that she has no cover against. Yeah! Okay. Target so, disabled. it pretty much uh, boils down to RNG here, guys. At least we know where they are! Yeah, we do. Uh-oh. Hey, at least he took his action. Uh-oh. No! Crap! No, don't die. Dead. Damn it. This guy's on Overwatch. Okay. Okay. 
Ya. Me dirijo allí. Ven y verás. All right, bro, guy. <laughs> He missed it that distance too. Ajustando miras. Me disparan. Out. Nice. Okay, so I've only got two guys left. Sixty-one percent chance. Wait a second. This guy is not on Overwatch or anything. So. I'm just going to run up. Here. On target position now. Oh, hey. Look at that. Target down. Train an ammo fast. Thank you, Gavin. Okay, so... Not sure... I'll go over here... Do I even have a line of sight to that door? Not unless I go way the hell over here. Stepping off. Please. Oh no! Ouch! 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 Ooh, he didn't die. That all you got? Here and unload the can of whoop ass on you. Good luck, me. Blanco neutralizado. Okay. Area is secure. We're not picking up any inbound contacts. All right. Are clear. Menace one five. We have a limited window to act before advent responds. We need to get those charges planted on the double. Yeah, I'm working on it. Let me plant them, please. Menace one five. Rendezvous at the extraction point. Status confirmed. Squad is clear. Dead yeah, no joke. Hooray! That was rough as hell. 
but to, in my own defense, I have to say this is what happens when they're not clear about all the objectives to begin with. You know? Oh, thank you very much, Kevin. Um, yeah, that, that was some pretty rough stuff there. Well, hmm. okay. I mean, he's so cute. Poor Soto. You did a good job, girl. The Ranger serves as our primary reconnaissance unit, capable of moving independently in concealment while engaging enemies at close range. Um, yeah, maybe, um, okay, carry on. Yes, the rangers are very cool. Okay, let's promote. Just like it sounds, our sharpshooters engage enemy targets with pinpoint nice. accuracy from extreme range. They're also trained in pistol marksmanship for the occasional close encounter. Serving as our demolitions experts, the Grenadiers provide heavy ordnance delivery whenever and wherever we need it. Alrighty. Well. Alright. Launch grenade, I love it. to the research labs. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah. Well, aside from us getting this ship up and running, which was mostly Dr. Shen's work, I haven't felt particularly useful in a long time. I'm more than happy to leave the hard decisions to the commander. For most of our soldiers, the living quarters on board the Avenger are a step up from the conditions they've had to live with on the ground. Okay, sweet. So... Uh, I can't... Uh, okay. Well, let's go to the research lab. Impressive, isn't it? Yeah. Capable of generating immense power. You're completely harmless to human life. If only the same could be said for the rest of the aliens' technology, Commander. Dr. Richard Tigan, Chief Science Officer. I am responsible for the entirety of our research here, as well as the procedure you so recently underwent. Welcome to my lab, such as it is. I'm not sure what Central may have told you, but we found something while removing you from the alien stasis suit. A device 
implanted directly in your occipital lobe. Had I access to the equipment available to me during my tenure at Advent, I would already know the precise nature of its function. However, given time and your approval, of course, Commander, I assure you, I will find out. Which brings to light an additional point. Though aspects <coughs> of this facility are indeed impressive, I am but one man. Were you to direct additional support personnel and resources to me, I could substantially improve the speed of all our research. Give me more warm bodies, bro. A farewell, Commander. <laughs> you scientists, nothing. Well, new research. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and go for the uh, hybrid materials here. I do find here. that area of research to be among the more intriguing options available. We'll begin work immediately. I'll send word when a complete report is available. The resistance is slightly more organized. Okay, reworked your repulsors with some of the parts I salvaged yeah. from your old engine. Should fix that stabilization problem you had. I don't know if you all, Come if you on, remember Rover. the sign of the engineer from the first game. This girl here is his granddaughter. Commander. Getting our tech to talk to theirs is harder than you think. Lily Shen, Chief Engineer, at your service. You are probably expecting to see my father. In all that's happened, I'm guessing Central didn't tell you yet. He's gone. Dad gave everything he had to get us this far this entire ship is his life's work i know he would have loved to show you around the place himself he used to talk about you a lot you can be sure i'm ready to finish what he started might not look it but in here i can fabricate pretty much anything you come up with and with a little more help well, you'd be amazed with what I can do. It was an honor to finally meet you, Commander. And Rover's a badass. Hmm. No engineers. Let's see what we have. There's room for us to expand our facilities on board the Avenger, Commander, but we'll need more engineers to clear out space for construction first. Out of curiosity, what do I have? What options do I have? Okay, so now I'm starting to remember things. Supplies and power. Okay, let's look at items. You'd be surprised how big of a difference some of these things can make in combat, Commander. With a few supplies, I can manufacture anything we need in no time. Clearing some of these alien debris. Commander, I'm going to need more help on the engineering team before I can start clearing out some of these other rooms. We should recruit an engineer. Okay, so I can't do that yet. 
I wonder if this is what it was like in the old days. Always on edge, ready for a fight on a moment's notice. Certainly keeps you on your toes. So, uh, hearing angry cat noise is the one to check that out. Bro, you're top of the list. Let's get you. Come on. Oh, okay. I can change their appearance. Well, I don't really care about that. Kids on anybody without losing their grenade right now. Hmm. I think some armor becomes available later that uh, lets me uh, do that. So. Objectives, objectives none. So, what can I do for you, Commander? Can't build anything yet. Probably not. So, <laughs> right. no, that's good stuff, bro. Um, Just give the word and I'll get started, Commander. So, how the hell do I? Re oh, I remember you have to complete missions to get engineers and scientists and stuff. Totally forgot. Okay. So, I guess there's no other place to go but the bridge. Commander, good to see you on your feet again. Welcome to the bridge. The nerve center of our operation. The aliens have our entire world in their grip. Advent controls everything. Government, communications, industry. Not to mention the military. And it's on us to take it all back. Resources and time are tight, Commander. It'll be up to you to decide how to best use both. The ship is yours. Oh yeah, bro. While we prepare for new operations and continue our research, we can pass time by scanning at sites like this one. On your order, we'll start our scans on the surrounding area. Commander, one of our resistance contacts just tipped us off to a site that may be worth investigating. 
Okay. Uh, not right this second. Drop 21 days. There isn't really anything else to do here, it looks like. So, let's Avenger go ahead and do this. new course. Commander, the Avengers remote scanning capabilities will help us search the area for clues or other resources. It's going to take some time, though. We've got a lot of ground to cover. The outcome of this research can only further our advances, Commander. Fantastic. Let's... Ooh, and let's heal dust and play your armor. Okay. All right. Ten alien alloys, which I don't have. I had a feeling you'd make that research a priority, Commander. I'll notify you as soon as the report is available. New orders, Commander. Let's see. Let's go ahead and try to build one of these. See if I can put it on somebody. Your old man would be proud of what we've managed to do here. What uh, you've managed to do with this ship. I just wish he had lived long enough to see us fight back. To know that it wasn't all for nothing. Trust me, he knows. If there was one thing your father always kept in mind, it was his faith in humanity. He knew we could win on our own terms. Huh. I see. I remember now. Okay. I'm gonna put the med kit on her. didn't change her health or anything, but, all right. Didn't change the look or anything. So. Whatever. Oh, okay. Might as well switch this stuff up real quick here. Yeah, get them the old XCOM armor. Okay, that's what it is. Just some stylized stuff here. With the actual XCOM logo on it. Actually, I'll quit messing around here. And, uh, let's Beardsley. Okay. Hell yeah. 
setting course for the Mexican regional track. So I got a new soldier. All right. Where is it? Where is this disabled truck? Okay. Let me quick. I've got a new soldier here. I want to take a look at them. Specialist. Oh, they're the rain. Oh, I remember that. Okay. So, resistance warrior armor specialist. And you got the gremlin and the frag. So, at least I have a full team of uh, higher rank. Well, yeah. Not a, well, I do have a full team of higher rank beats, but. That doesn't matter right now. Just get back out there and go to this disabled truck. New course. Commander, as the resistance continues to grow, we'll have a better chance of finding openings to strike back at Advent. As it is, we've already identified a potential target to disrupt the aliens' operations in this region. Our window of opportunity is limited, so we'll have to move fast. Difficulty easy. And I get an engineer. Hmm. Damn. I don't know if I have the uh, wherewithal to uh, <clears throat> go through a whole nother mission for you all right now. I'm almost at the two hour mark. Um, I'm going to go ahead and save and exit. Uh, so, well. As you can see, this uh, this game is challenging as fuck. If the RNG does not go your way, you're you're hurt. You know, if it does go your way, it can go as smoothly as my last adventure did. Although, as you can see, I did change my overall tactics since uh, you know the game uh, comes up and tells you, oh yeah, we're gonna you only need to go plant this explosive and then after you accomplish that kill everyone in the area that was kind of an unfortunate thing so I just essentially uh, reset my priorities let's get these guys taken care of then plant our explosives and run away which uh, obviously is the tactically sound decision to make here um, I keep looking all up at my camp my other monitor and stuff here Mainly to see, uh, I'm not looking derpy, but it makes me look derpy by uh, sitting there looking straight up. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, having trouble with that first mission. Remember where your baddies are coming out? They're coming out right up front there and around the back. You know where they are. Creep around and get them in your field of fire. And once you've got a good grenade throw, started on that freaking officer because he's literally twice as tough as the rest of them. And that's a good start to that fight on a higher difficulty. In fact, this is the... I have not completed this game at all. And this is the highest difficulty I've ever attempted on XCOM 2. So, uh, yeah, me dying a lot is not unexpected. 
But, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, say thank you all for watching. I hope you have a great night. And I will be back on Friday, Sci-Fi Friday. Uh, not 100% sure what I'm going to play this Friday yet. But it'll fall in the genre. Until then, you have a great one. Bye-bye.